Paragraph 42. Times of Silence. It is in silence that the soul reaches the depths of contemplation. Place your mind before the mirror of eternity. Place your soul in the brilliance of glory. Place your heart in the figure of the divine substance. And through contemplation, transform your entire being into the image of the Godhead itself. As St. Clair so eloquently writes, it is in silence and adoration that one is transformed into the image of the Godhead itself. These times of silence make evangelical silence possible because it is in these moments where we are able to listen to the divine lover of our souls speaking without any unnecessary distractions. It is in the greatest silence that the voice of God can more clearly be heard for this reason, when possible to do so, we welcome silence in the day and seek opportunities where we can have this silence. Reflection So the Lord speaks to us most clearly in silence. And He speaks to us more clearly in silence because He wants to draw near to us. He whispers to us because He wants our head to be drawn ever closer to him. And it is in the silence that we hear him so well in our hearts. When all the other voices are still, we can more readily hear his voice. But he is not going to take up second place in our heart. If our hearts are already given to other things, then we will not be able to hear him as clearly. Because the Lord does not fight with us. He lets us do what we want, and He gently nudges us to seek Him and to follow Him. So as we put forth the effort and we search for Him in the silence and in adoration, we will find Him. If we seek Him, we will find Him. He knocks, and if we open the door, He will come in. An evangelical silence it is important because it's keeping our minds clear of all unnecessary conversations. And having times of silence, set times of silence in our day, actually helps us to have evangelical silence when we may be in a busy uh, parking area, must be on a bus, or some other place where there's lots of people all around. Evangelical silence is possible to have, even in the midst of lots of people around, if we have created and fostered an atmosphere of silence at other times in our life. And if you like what you've been listening to, then I encourage you to subscribe to our channel down below. God bless you.